Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, still a little bit down, the eyes kicking my butt. But today's video, we're gonna look at something that I've I've never even really done. I'll be honest with you. I turned the noise control, which I usually always leave on low. I was in perspective mode and I just got to tinkering with it a little bit. And I said, hey, what does it, what happens if I turn it on high? How does that affect the picture? And man, it got amazingly clear and the images looked, you know, beautiful, almost like to the quality of Mega Live 3 or Mega 360. But I noticed that the, uh, you kind of lose some of your liveness. Uh, the fish don't, you know, there's a lot, the fish don't seem to be moving as much. They seem to be more stationary. Um, although it looks more crisp, you lose some of the fine detail that you lose with, you know, with it off, with it on off low or um, even medium. But man, the, the pictures look beautiful and crisp. And um, I'm still waiting on a Summit fishing equipment mount. So I'm using the Garmin mount. Uh, it's not in a bad angle. It's a better angle than it used to be. But also I want to talk about a couple other things. Check out after the little part uh, that we look at the video here. And I've got some announcements for the 10,000 giveaway. So, Let's go. You know, as I'm going along, I decided, I mean, you know, I want to tinker with this a little bit. And so I went into it and I said, you know, let's take a look at what the effects of the noise reject on high do. And immediately you see how much smoother the image gets. Now, I mean, we've run over this area before with side imaging, but you can see the, the, the dimples in the mud. The fish movement is not as crisp. Uh, as I thought it would be, um, but that's because it's filtering out a lot of the stuff right here. And I'm still not sure that ain't a boat right there in about four and a half foot of water, but I think it's a big old log. But I just wanted to show you some of the things that and how it looked with it on high. But one thing that I noticed that it filtered out more than anything on high is the wave action. By turning it on, the surface waves completely disappeared off the screen and so that is something if you're having a lot of wave action a lot of ripple action or a lot of the uh, surface um, noise well you could turn that noise jack on high and get it and get it gone now before anybody gets me with 11.6 I had a charger go bad and they are overnighting me a new charger I did not realize the charger was bad till I got out on the water this day um, so it is what it is, so a little bit low voltage. But I want you to notice just like I'm, I'm driving around, I'm just kind of just kind of meandering around. Um, the images aren't quite as sharp as, as they are when you have them off uh, when you're moving. But when you begin to stabilize a little bit, man, those images sharpen up real quick. You can see a fish sitting in that dimple right there. Um, so the images are are really beautiful now granted i'm i'm, I'm kind of getting i'm just getting used to the, the lvs 34 um so i'm still learning all the settings on this because they are uh it's a little bit more adjustable and um so it's a little bit more adjustable it's a little bit you can tinker a little bit more and really tune it in and as i get it really really tuned in i'm probably that's when i'll put a settings video out but i just wanted you to see that you know uh, something that I haven't used a lot of is is you know the noise reject and really I don't really play with the settings much in perspective mode and maybe that's something I'll be playing with more and more to really get it fine tuned in and find you know the detail to be perfect and um, right here I'm going to pull up on a boat ramp I mean you can see it see that well you can see the end of that boat ramp so beautiful look at the shadow of it you can see you know see a fish shadow on the left hand side of it you can see a fish in just a second but look down the middle you can see the little drain flute um, where the water drains out when it rains and up in the top of right hand corner that's a log that's laid on the edge of it um, but I'm coming into the bank here but I, I just think it's beautiful and maybe give a uh, noise projection all right let's uh you know what you think about that I think it's really cool and, and I'm still experimenting and learning with this 34 I had the 32 so dialed in it was unreal now we're learning with the 34 um and but let's get into these announcements june 
I make sure I got this right. June 11th, which is Monday. Let's say Monday. Yes, Friday night, 10th, 11th. Yes, it's Monday at about 7.30 p.m. Still tentative on that, but it should be 7.30 p.m. I'm going to go live, and I'm, I've got, I'm working on a couple more things. I posted the list of everything we're giving away. Um, 93 UHD. Complete LVS32 system with black box. XHD mount. Um, giving away the live scanner. Um, we're giving away... What are we giving? Oh, probably either a live... Core, uh, one of the new courses that I've done, the Garmin Livescope Masterclass, which we'll talk more about that that day, um, or on, on the water class, kind of get one of the other um, five or uh, four Chatty Boys card gift cards, which Chatty Boys has been an amazing sponsor of this channel, and they continue to be. I have some huge, huge announcements for them. Huge announcements. We're going to do a whole video on that. Just because you're Garmin Guru people, you're going to get some amazing deals and free items, free gifts from the Guru, baby. That's right, from the Guru. See, I don't take money from them. I turn around and I give it back to y'all in terms, in forms of gift cards, things like that. So anything I've ever made, I always turn around and give it back to you guys, and I'm going to give it to you in a crazy way. So stay tuned for that. Um, going to have some... Um, some baits and some shirts, uh, a lot of stuff. And I've also got the four Garmin Guru shirts. I've already got those winners drawn. We're just going to do everything Monday. And uh, we're going to talk about a few things, but we're going to have a big time Monday. I think y'all are going to love this. But guys, remember, keep sharing the pages. Keep sharing the videos. Like them. Comment. I love to talk to everybody. I try to answer every question. And ring the bell.